Morning, Marge. I thought we talked about the image that you present to your fellow doctors and patients when you use a pill bottle for your Tic Tacs. What? It's quirky and interesting. I'm like house minus the limp and unconvincing American accent. Hmm. How's the missus? She's good. Susie started using that air fryer that I got her for Christmas, so you're more than welcome to come over for an all-you-can-eat burnt cauliflower pizza buffet. Sounds amazing. What? What is it? Third page of the waiting roster. He thinks he's a what? I can see from your personal info sheet that I'm not the first medical professional that you've sought out regarding your condition. Uh, what can you tell me about what you're experiencing, Xander? Xander? <laughs> Are you... I'm sorry. <clears throat> that um, tends to happen whenever I'm stressed. You puke colorful fabric? Yeah, or um, playing cards, or marbles. This one time I even spit out fire. Don't ask me how that works, I have no clue. Okay, um, listen, Richard. Are you a dick? No? No? Okay, Richard it is. Um, look, uh, like you said, you're not the first doctor I've come to asking for help. I've seen an epidemiologist, an endocrinologist, a hepatologist, a neurosurgeon, uh, even witch doctors, which was a fun crowd, and they've all looked at me the same way you're looking at me now. Except for the witch doctors. I think they wanted to harvest my spleen. Look, Richard, um, <laughs> I need your help. I'm running out of options here. This thing is ruining my life. Well, if we're going to figure this thing out, we'll need to start from the beginning. Now, you uh, said this started happening about six weeks ago, correct? Yeah. I mean, it was small stuff at first, things that flew under the radar, but eventually things got a little more awkward. Awkward? How so? Well, ducky soap. It's obvious. Right, it's, it's right, right there. there. <laughs> you just gave it to me. Hey, hey, allow me. I got it, I got it. My card's not in here. Oh, don't worry, you can get the next one. What? I could have, I could have sworn that Is that my card? Um, yeah, I, I guess it is. Okay, now wait a second, I, I didn't do that. <laughs> it's okay, I have to go to... So are you free next Saturday? Not my proudest moment, obviously. I'm just surprised you asked for another date. Uh, so we're talking about Occasional, accidental kleptomania. Oh, no, no, no. I'm afraid it gets much weirder than that. Hey, hey, uh, hey, I'm sorry, officer, that's my car. And that's a fire hydrant, currently keeping the citizens of this street from danger under 15 feet from your vehicle. Come on, how much under are we talking about here? Put the marker right there of the 15 feet. You should know I take no pleasure in this, but somebody's gotta defend the law, and that, that moved. Did you move my marker? No, no, I didn't, I swear. Well, regardless, it's close enough, and the law is the law, so...
It's a long story. Just gonna. Full disclosure, something's going to hatch out of that. I just have literally no idea what. So, uh, Doc, what can I do here? <laughs> this thing is a nightmare, and it seems like no matter what I do, I can't get rid of it. You know what? There are some experimental treatments out of Eastern Europe that we just got in the other day. Really? Let me go get you some of that medication right now. Ha! Huh. Hey, um, little girl, you might want to stay away from me. I'm, I'm pretty dangerous, okay? Ha! 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 You, um, you liked that. Hey, do you um want to see another trick? Yeah? Here you go, little one. Thank you, Mr. Magician, sir. a day and this pesky magic knack comes to an end. You know, I think I'm good. You're good? Yeah. I, this is really weird, but um, maybe that's just because I don't understand it. But I could. I guess I just never really saw my life going this way. When I was little, I wanted to be a math pirate. Don't ask me what that entails. I was a really dumb kid. But somewhere along the way, I figured out I wanted to help people. Helping people can look like a whole hell of a lot of different things. Doing your part to make the world a little brighter, that's magic. Thank you, Mr. Lawrence. Truly. 